Welcome back to Home Repair Hub. If your Rinnai tankless water heater is experiencing ignition failure, leaving you with cold water, you've come to the right place. I'm here to walk you through the steps to diagnose and fix the problem. Let's fire up your water heater and get that hot water flowing again. Ignition issues can be tricky, but with a bit of know-how, we can tackle this together. First and foremost, let's talk safety. Make sure to turn off the power to your heater to prevent any electrical hazards during our troubleshooting. With the power off, let's start with the basics. Check to see if your gas valve is fully open. If it's not, your heater won't ignite. Next, we'll check the gas type and pressure. Your Rinnai must have the correct gas type and adequate pressure to function properly. If your gas supply checks out, let's move on to the ignition components. A dirty flame rod or a faulty igniter can prevent ignition. Carefully clean the flame rod with a soft cloth or fine sandpaper. As for the igniter, if it's damaged or corroded, it might need replacing. Remember, working with these components can be delicate. If you're not comfortable with this step or the problem persists, it's time to call a professional. After addressing these common ignition issues, go ahead and turn the power back on. Try to ignite your water heater and see if the problem is solved. And that's how you tackle a no ignition issue with your Rinnai tankless water heater. If this video lit the way to a solution, please like and subscribe for more helpful home repair guides. Got questions or need more help? Drop a comment below and I'll get back to you with answers. Keep your home cozy and your water hot.